Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name is Ken. Today's experiment is cup centrifugal force. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is plastic cups, two ping pong balls, hot glue gun, and a pencil. Set this experiment up. You need clear plastic cups uh, and two ping pong balls. Put those in one of the cups. Then take your hot glue gun. Have an adult help you with this as the hot glue is very, very hot and you can burn yourself. Go all the way around on the outside uh, top of the, the cup uh, rim right here. And when you get completely all the way down with the glue, uh, then you're going to take the other cup and you're going to seal it off uh, by just putting it on top. Uh, the hot glue should you know, glue within 15, 20 seconds. Varies on each gun. But once you're done, you've got your uh, pretty much set up. You have one more piece to put on. And we're going to hot glue the pencil kind of like a... A holder so I check there it's all sealed up and we put the pencil right in the middle here so we put a little bit of hot glue on the eraser end uh, put a whole bunch on because you want this to really stay on um, I'm going to probably have to add a little bit more than that uh, then hold it down until it dries it just take a little bit and then you're ready to go so the object of this experiment is to separate the two balls put one ball in each glass this seems tough but if you place the glass on the table and put the balls right in the middle and just give it a spin you'll see the spinning glass makes the balls fly towards the extreme ends just like this just like when you swing an object around on a, a string or a rope the object will pull outward on the string this is called the centrifugal, centrifugal. just like when you swing an object around on a string or a rope the object will pull outward on the string this is called the centrifugal force. It is called by the inertia of the object, where it seeks to follow the straight line of path. The centrifugal force is equal and opposite to the centripetal force that acts upon an object, causing the object to curve in a line. An amusement park ride is a perfect example that it shows the centrifugal force of the roller coaster. When the roller coaster goes over that curved top of the tracks, you feel the centrifugal force pulling you upward. Likewise, at the lower curved part of the tracks, you feel the force pushing you downwards. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to click thumbs up and to subscribe as we do a new video every day. Thanks for watching.